So bro, this aside, I just want to sit down and talk about Stellar Blade for a bit. This game is truly something. Shift Up, you guys have made something that honestly, I really enjoy a lot. I was never really interested into like the Souls-like games, but the fact that this is kind of like a Souls game because it has that soul aspect to it. And then it also has that near uh, Devil May Cry fact to it. I really wasn't expecting me to like be as invested as I was, but holy, this really blew a lot of things out the water. I played it nonstop since release, and even though I finished the game like two weeks ago and I'm currently are playing it on New Game Plus, I gotta talk about it. I really do. This game, if you haven't tried it, it is one of I would not even one of it literally is the game of the year for me i don't know anything that's going to top it until sparking zero comes out because to be honest that's dragon ball that's a whole other story <laughs> but this game it sets the bar right now for me it made me want to pick up elden ring which i did and i will be bringing you guys through that with me and i just gotta say that this game is worth a shot if you haven't played the demo i would say try it out it's worth a shot it's nothing that can hurt you it's literally just it's the demo and then they even have a two-hour trial on the five that literally allows you to play from your demo save all the way for like two hours and then there you go it gives enough aspect to it that made me want to dive enough to really explore the world the combat was enough for me to really indulge into it the characters like voice acting wise was amazing it actually captivated me and made me want to like listen to like how the lore is going how the story is going the story is actually like really good it's not no bare bones story i don't want to like say too much in two of the story because i feel like the demo kind of sets what the whole story will be about in a way but at the same time i can't really say if it does but i feel like it was enough to at least make you want to continue more <laughs> at least i feel like the demo does that enough uh but it made me want to really play more i i even though i finished the game and even though I, there's a lot of times where i'm on the, where i'm playing it new game plus wise and i'm probably not even actually doing the story for new game plus and i'm just exploring i'm still having a good time like the music alone is what sets the bar for me too because it's the same person that did the music for Nier Automata, the music in here is no is no different. It literally hits the same. When there's combat, it switches up and is a whole different thing. When there is like a whole new area, the music switches up again. Uh, heck, the Great Desert, if you guys know that music, it is literally top tier alone. There's three. What area has three different songs that switch up? Uh, sit so seamlessly when you just go just a few steps over to just a little area and then you come right back and it transitions right back that is so sick i know a lot of games do that but i gotta praise the word the praise is due <laughs> this game is amazing it's so good and i love how they're constantly updating it i did find out that there's a roadmap where they're like where they're updating things so i'm hoping this game gets updated like non-stop i hope it like gets a lot more love because it it, it deserves it it really does i don't want to like make it sound like i'm giving this like the holy grail or anything but i have to say that for this being a first time port and being their first triple a game or just a console port in general when the other game that i at least i know that they've done was at least a gotcha game this being like their first like big thing they knocked it out the park they really knocked it out the park and they they deserve the praise for that they really do they did so stinking well it is 
I literally, if it was up to me, I would be like advertising this all day, every day, because this is it's so stinking good for me. If you want to know what I rate it, I got to give it at least at least right now a 9.5. And the only reason why it's a 0.5 and not like a 10 or anything like that is because I got to see what they will add and what they will do to make it better. It can become a 10. And to be honest, I would say it's a 10, but I got to see what they will add if they even add anything to make it better because there's a lot they can do and I feel like if they add more, if there's like because if there's things like DLC, if there's things like a sequel, if there's things like um I don't know, I want to say like extra like end game content like we have a boss rush mode which is so sick where you can just go back and just fight all the bosses just because you can and that's so sick and it, it's just depending on the things they add it may go up to a 10 because i'm not gonna lie this game is going to be by far one of the best games i have played in a hot long time and i will stand by that i will stand by that the thing is shift up i just hope your music is uh non-copyright because i definitely want to blast some of your music throughout like like at least permanently <laughs> from here on out so i hope that is like non-copyright because that's gonna hurt if it is we're gonna find out how this video goes we'll see on that one if you guys hear uh stellar blade music you know what happened <laughs> <laughs> but uh i gotta say this game is good if you haven't tried it give it a shot and if you are thinking if you if you are leaning on if it's worth the what would that be 75 because yeah 75 if you're uh debating if it's worth the 75 right now i would have to say it depends because currently for me no other games like really hidden for me until sparking zero which isn't until october <laughs> let's go uh but if there's nothing really hidden for you then i would say it's up to you on that department if you are willing to give it a shot go ahead if not then it's up to you i would say it's worth 75 or the full price but that could also be because it actually was the game that kind of made me get pushed into like the genre of souls games so it kind of made me want to it makes me want to dive into a new genre which is something that hasn't happened in a minute for me so that could be the main reason why but for some people they may not it may not be the same so it really just depends but i will say anything below 30 is a steal <laughs> or not 30 well yeah anything below 30 is a steal 100 percent it's so good but uh definitely give the trial a shot if you guys are interested give the demo a shot if you guys are interested and i've even made a video over playing the first actually yeah not even yeah it was the demo actually i made a video literally playing the demo so if you guys just want to see me play the demo i'll have it at the end of this and if you guys want to see me actually play the game like another part even if it's spoil related just let me know in the comments i'll be willing to play it because to be honest this game is sick <laughs> so just let me know there and i will definitely be down to play it so without further ado i'm gonna let you guys go my name is tugenix and i will see you kings and queens on the next one shift up i'm looking forward to your next game because uh project witches your next game i'm gonna be there i'm gonna be there and i'm gonna let y'all keep i'm gonna keep y'all up to date with that one too let's see what y'all got in the future